Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the masking tools in Filmora 11. Okay, so this is a simple tutorial for beginners. So hopefully this video can help you understand the software better and create better video here on this platform. Okay, so if you don't have Filmora 11 yet, I will put the link in the description for you to download the software. And also I will leave 20% discount coupon code in the description also or something right here at the corner of the video so let's go to my computer screen all right so let's start a new project uh, this is my computer screen and we're going to create a new project uh, so first thing first let's talk about the mask so what is the mask and how to use it and actually it is very simple if you have two video overlay on each other for example this is the first video on the first track and then you have another video on the second track or about the about the, the this video uh, if you put an image mask on the top video then you will see the bottom video okay so it is simple like that all right uh, let me show you so first thing i'm i'm going to overlay two video on the timeline so i'm going to use a stock media at my downloaded folder at a stock media and this is the first one yeah let's put it at the first track and then we need one more track so we can just click this button to add one more one more video track on the timeline so this is track number one and now i want to put this video on track number two so we are at number one and number two so when we play the video we only see this one the track number two okay see we have a rain rainy days okay and let's click this button to view everything on the timeline so supposing that I want to create a split screen, maybe side by side split screen for this video. And what I'm going to do is to use the image mask or the masking tools in Filmora 11. Okay, for example, we can just double click at the video on top. Okay, just double click and then find the mask tab here. So we have video, color and animation start like that when we go back to the video we have some information right here we have the basic and we have the mask here okay so if we select the mask we have the preset mask for you to add it to your video and you can also import uh, your own image mask uh, maybe you create uh, with a Photoshop or other image editor start like that okay so for this example I'm going to create a a side by side split screen so we are going to use this one the single line okay just click on that and you can see here we we can see this is the top video and this is the bottom video okay and then we can just play nice right and if you want to uh, create an animated mask for your video in Filmora 11 it is also possible for example at the first position uh, let's put the playhead at the first position on the video at this side and then go to mask and now you can add one keyframe right here so, okay so we can have a keyframe here and then we can add the first keyframe so add the first keyframe and then you can click here on the preview window and adjust the mask to this side so this is the first keyframe meaning that you only see the the first clip and then you want to move some frame forward and then uh, change the mask position so that you can see uh, the second clip here on the timeline okay so just move the playhead to some frame forward and then you can click here at the preview window and then adjust the mask okay to this side okay and the plus strength i want to reduce it to about 10 or stuff like that, 10 or 12. And now we have an animated mask effect. Okay, let's play it. See? All right, so now we have a side-by-side -side split screen. By the way, at this position, for example, we just want to, to move this mask all the way to the right to show the video at the bottom. Okay, so we can just add one more keyframe for the mask right here and then move some frame forward and then we can click here at the preview window and then move the mask to all the way to the right 
and now we have this if I Very nice, right? So that is how to use the, the image mask or the masking tool in Filmora 11. And actually you have some option right here. For example, you can also uh, rotate the mask if you want. Okay, so for example, I can just go to this position. Okay, so this position so here. And we can add a rotation effect for the mask also. This position and I'm going to put it at the this keyframe and now i want to rotate it rotate the mask by 90 percent okay and now let's play the mask uh, effect now very nice right and you can also invert the mask so for example if we put Put the playhead here and then we can click inverse the mask then we will it will show the bottom video first and then add a mask effect to the second video so the top video okay so let's play it and rotation okay so it is very nice right and the last option in the masking tool in Filmora 11 is to save this mask as custom okay so we can just save it as custom and let's say mask number one okay and let's click ok and click ok again and now if you have two video two different video and you want to apply the same uh, mask effect for your video you can do like this so just delete this first for example i can just delete all this thing and then i'm going to put another video here and this video okay and now i want to apply the same mask effect for this video okay so this running video okay so let's click this button to view everything on the timeline all i need to do is to double click at the clip here and then find the mask tab here okay and now we have a custom mask effect uh, let's go here go up here and then we can scroll down here so we have the custom mask effect here just click here to apply it for your video and now you have the same keyframe with the same mask effect okay so let's click ok and now we can play the video and see the, the same mask effect okay so this is the same mask effect and we have just created let's play the video okay so the first one and mask to the center and then all right so that is everything you want to know about the new masking tool in Filmora 11. i hope this tutorial is helpful for you if you have any more questions just let me know in the comment section below thank you very much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye bye